Airbus plays a major contribution to the UK aerospace sector. Over £6 billion of turnover last year in the UK and we spent over £5 billion with 1,000 UK suppliers to our two sites. At the Filton site near Bristol, they're world leaders in wing design and here at Broughton, one of the biggest manufacturing plants in the UK. The ATI funded project has been absolutely key for us to take latest innovation and technology, develop it in an offline environment. We've got a fully flexible and adaptable jig here in the facility and we're able to prove those technologies offline and then when they're proven insert them into our production processes. The ATI project was really important for Airbus. Whilst on the face of it, it looks like lots of little small projects, it was all about industrial improvement and efficiency activities. So most of the research projects we've, I've been involved in over a number of years have been product orientated, so product design, whereas these projects are now looking at how we reduce the cost of those projects. What we've had an opportunity as well to do is to exploit those technologies on the shop floor in real production now. And we can really mature those then for the future aircraft. So we're ready to go with new technologies. This ATI funded programme has allowed us to work in a number of different streams. I'd say one element is it's completely changed the way in which we'll develop the architecture of our future aircraft. More fundamentally, it's also helped develop our academic technology centre partners and our industrial partners to the right level so that we're ready to work together now for the future programmes to come. The ATI advisory role has really helped us to steer a number of our technical topics and that's been invaluable in many senses to set a direction, to build the networks and to move forward. Many people don't understand how complex wings are to manufacture and, des and design, uh, but I think ATI get it. I think they really understand it's a very complex industry we've got and a fantastic opportunity for the UK to retain that capability and develop that further. Future aircraft we will build uh, totally rely on these sort of research projects. What they do is they give us a great foundation of individual technologies that we can then integrate into a new product. What we can then do is look for a revolutionary change in our manufacturing processes and in our industrial system. Thank you.